can do that from a safe distance on the ground, but you can't go on the billboard, okay? So this is going to be the end of this. He's blocking himself in some type of area right now, and there's going to be one way in, one way out. Unless he went off-road and went down. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office in the 2020 marked explorer i wasn't sure if i've used this or the slick top one before i just i really could not remember and looking through the thumbnails i might have not used like a picture of the car even though i'm pretty sure i would have for 2020 um but we're jumping in with a marked unit uh that way we have alprs but the alpr script isn't working right this second or it, i just can't open it i'm not sure what's up so really quick i'm going to go ahead and go down to extras and we're just going to take a peek at what the slick top would look like so this is what the lights would look on which actually look really really good on the 2020 uh just a slick top of this but i can't remember if i use this or something else possibly um i don't know maybe we could do half half we could start off with a marked unit and then go to the slick top that would probably be cool i always say that and then totally forget but you know what they say so i'm gonna swap this back over really quick and then take off that light bar but let's go ahead and jump into this and see what we can get into we just finished getting gas here and there's a vehicle pursuit going on that we got attached to a supervisor and i actually totally forgot that while i was doing the intro there uh but i believe i just okay, heard so units right. passing northbound sonora, freeway 099. northbound sonora freeway 099 so they're going to be heading oh i see the helicopter unit so hey, they're not Packers that far kicking and other vehicles at this time kicking in other vehicles you know what i also need to do i just need to turn down all game stuff like one click like i had before we just also got attached to that call so that's gonna be fantastic please get the fuck out of the way god damn i love this car it's been a long time i would say like a couple weeks here since i've actually used this vehicle it feels like uh since i've got in for some other cars there so it's nice to be back in it feels good feels prominent on the road which is nice yeah, and they are pretty goddamn fast, so that's always a plus in this situation, too. I think they're still heading out. Yeah, they are. So they have about four or five units on the pursuit. We are the supervisor that's attached. It's going to take us a hot minute to catch up. It is a motorcycle, too, so they're going to be able to take off fairly fast from the ground units that might be chasing them. Unless we have another bike into the mix as well. I need a seatbelt. What am I doing? I'm surprised I even noticed that. I didn't want to die, so, you know, I want to throw that bitch on. Just past the run station. So, I'd say we're catching up. Uh, I mean, we're not covering a ton of ground here. We are going 120 miles per hour. I got to get on the left side here. Oh, somebody going to die. Somebody going to die, and it's going to be me. Holy shit. Let's, oh, okay. So subject just major 1050. We got him stopped on his own accord there because, you know, it's all about those driving skills if you're in a pursuit. And I think we just had like a 45 minute pursuit or 43 minutes or something like that in a couple episodes ago. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta be able to do better. You either gotta be able to dip on him or something. I don't know where the fuck they're at too. Okay, I see helicopter. Okay, looks like it was a desync issue. Was it really though? That was the question. Who knows? But I guess we're gonna be able to catch up. I don't want to. I don't want to cheat the system. You have all those cops that are already gonna be on it, so I don't want to show up and be just in a line. So I'm just gonna let them kind of reset up and do their thing. And as soon as they leave, wherever the fuck they're at, we'll join it. Okay, they're taking back off, so we're gonna take back off as well too. I think they were farther down than I thought they were. I thought they were at this parking lot right here, but it looks like they're way farther down. Uh, I think they're passing the lumber yard or somewhere near that. Another 1050. Okay, so one 1050 and then the uh, the other ones continued here, but it's funny because they just set up from a 22 after the uh, 1050 there, and then one of them actually crashes again. That's fucked. But uh, better driving skills, you gotta do it, you gotta do better. You gotta be better to do better. Alright, motor unit. Wait, did he say turning back around to the county or just going back down southbound to the county? Where is the uh, TC too? Oh, here we go. Okay, so a helicopter's gonna have to break off just a little. We're behind an HP unit. I don't know if he TC'd or something. Uh, but we're going to stick behind him. Oh, somebody going to die again, dude. I can feel it. 
Hopefully our 2020 is still looking solid. Oh, I just scratched that, though. Front, away. Yep, that's a police car. Thanks, Radar. Appreciate that, bud. Oh, I see. I think I see the units. Yep, entering the tunnel. So we're actually caught up to the pursuit now. Rear away. This is going to be sketchy, dude. I got to respond on the left. He's responding on the right. Secondary Second back. Oh, damn. They just died. RIP people that are driving there. I'm going to try to focus on driving, too, since we're actually with units. I want to make sure we're not burning the shit out of anyone. So I have these laps of just not talking. It's not because I've forgot what I'm doing and lost my mind. Holy shit. Make a wider turn, bro. Oh, my God. That was ridiculous. At least we got gas this time, too. That gas station reminded me of when I lost gas. Okay, right, where? Touch me, I'll stop it. Keep going. Copy, be advised. Bike coming back towards you guys. I'm gonna be ready for this bitch ass motherfucker. Right, we got one down. One. He's an injured officer. Alright, Air 5 1, if you just want to stay with the downed officer, I got logged on our bike here. No rush. Please send to our Marine in. Go, 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 bro. Go, 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 go. Just go, go. I'll take secondary. We're going to be back on the one stop on on Great Ocean. Okay, so he was already coming in hot speed, so I don't want to ruin his little show there. Gave him the benefit of the doubt that time. He's got locked, though, so we don't have to worry about losing him. All right, now we're southbound Great Ocean Highway. That bike is picking up a, an immense amount of speed. I'm uh, actually surprised here. Holy shit, we're whipping the fuck out of this car. Question is, the only way this guy, we're going to stop him is if he's in a 1050. There's no other way we're going to be able to stop this guy. We are catching up, though. Because uh, we can't. if we if we spike him, it'll just knock him off the bike and, like, kill him instantly. And that won't be good. We've already done that by accident. And on purpose. You know what they say. Okay, we got another unit behind us as well, too. It's intense. It's going down right now. We are responding on... Uh, we're all responding on the correct side, which I like to see. That's good. Ain't nobody gonna die. Looks like a police bike. Oh. Okay, he's gotta get gas. There's no way that Explorer's going faster. Fuck. He's gonna go up this way, so we're gonna turn around. I was gonna go opposite lanes, but that could get Down risky, and we don't want to risk it too much. Red Desert, he's on Red Desert, six seven seven. He might come back on the freeway. Uh, Air five one's increasing altitude, four fifty. All right, so that guy pulled a cheeky ass move, going wrong way on a freeway on ramp. Usually, lately, I've been following them just because they're putting the public at risk. We might as well keep a fucking vehicle. He's found San Andreas. I'm going to rock the siren right now because I don't want to catch a responding unit that's going the opposite way. Where is the helicopter? I got to see where they're at. Okay, they're just going down this way. Yeah, with all these uh, units not knowing where the fuck they need to go, this is where something bad could happen. Where do you turn left, though? Okay, he's coming up straight this way. Near pillbox. Tunnel near pillbox. So he just, he knew he was getting tracked by the helicopter. And uh, he broke the lock that the helicopter had. And now he's probably going to get off that bike. Or he's going to try to sneak out another way. We're going to try to get the pillbox. Yeah, right. Uh, needs a tunnel up in near uh, in a body. Stand by, I got him. Nope, never mind. Sir. Okay, so he's near pillbox. We're close to pillbox as well too. Might as well just map it because my dumb ass will get lost. He's in a body. We got units underneath us. It's sounding like they're coming up Tyson, everywhere, dude. Holy shit. Did he take off to get into uh, Let's see if we can find this motherfucker. Tough, but he went into the tunnel there. So I think he's going to be on the lower level then. Yeah, if he's uh, if he went to a quality. Wait, I see. 
Hold on, I see some type of light here. Puzzle 47, I can give you a brief uh, description regarding... Uh, I swear to God, I saw some type of like the orb there in the bush. Did, it, did no one else see that? It looked like it was the taillight of a bike that was ditched in the bush, uh, bush or something. That was weird. Okay, yeah, there's... Okay, maybe it's just... Oh, it's an accent light in the palm trees. Okay. We got a trooper down and also a subject down. So right now we have a perimeter set up on the area. We have no idea where the guy's at. We're searching anywhere we can. I am finding the light, so that's good. If there's a light in a bush, I will find that shit. So don't you worry about that. What the fuck, man? I'm going to pull up in this uh, alleyway, and we're just going to see if anyone can locate or find out any more information. But if we're kind of just blacked out in the area, at least we have... Someone that can assist immediately with uh, anything. You can tell God damn, that Jeep is going fast, bro. Uh, Son of a bitch. He was going super fast. I don't know if it's an actual person or not, but the way they were driving, too, seems to just be a little aggressive. Uh, they went up to about 60 there. It's a posted speed limit of 50. And we're just going to go ahead and keep an eye on it for a second. I just got their speed again at 40. It seemed to kind of just be all over the road, to be truthfully honest. Um, I'm not exactly sure what's going on. I, uh, uh, it's a give or take on that one. It's not really a crucial thing that I feel like I should have to do there. He stopped at the stop sign. Okay, we're going we're gonna to cut this guy a break. Even though, you know, I'd like to talk with someone, interact with someone. I've kind of just been driving around. Not much has been going on. I don't want to harass him over, you know, not driving absolutely perfect. Because that would kind of be fucked up here. So I'm just going to chill out. I'm going to just drive down the road here. If he chills out and just continues to drive down the road, no one will have any issues. But if he continues to, you know, amp it up a little, I'll be able to see. Okay, and we're going to definitely have a chat with him now because he went clear over that limit line. Now, if he's going to go ahead and come to a stop, you've got to come to a stop behind the line. If you pop your whole front end out into the intersection that you're turning into, definitely not going to be good. So we're going to have a chat with him. He knows it because he stopped and then looked and he sat there for a hot minute as he, saw, as he saw my car. He knows. He knows. Bro, I'll still light you up, dude. Go ahead. Walking 24, if you could send someone out, I'm about to light someone up. Copy. Okay, so guaranteed he's doing a lot of looking behind him right now. I'm going to, uh, I feel like I hear a helicopter unit tracking me too. He's playing the whole, I don't see you game. I'm not looking at my rear view mirrors. I'm going to not hit him with the siren just yet. I'm going to be a patient cop. You know what I mean? It's all about patience today, but he's clearly just pretending like he, you know what I mean? That attitude. All right. I feel like he's going to come to a stop here now. Like I said, I'm a very patient cop. I don't need to amp it up and use the siren like half the other cops. They would have been like, oh my god, he's not stopping. So we're going to get this on the radio uh, really quick before we get out and talk to him. That way we have zero issues. I can't see the motherfucking... Uh, it's like Ho Dollar or something. I don't know what it is. Hold on. How am I already half a tank of gas? What the fuck? I got to get on the radio here. All right, fucker, we're just going to talk to him. As soon as it gets open on the radio, I'll let him know because it's kind of sketchy if not. How are we doing? Pretty good, how are you? I'm doing good, uh, thank you. So I stopped you today because when you came up to that intersection there on uh, Route 68, coming from the junkyard, you had about... I don't know, I would say 40% of your car over the line there. You need to stop behind the line. Yeah, no, I know, I screwed up. I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, I know you I knew you saw me there because you sat at the stop sign for like 10, 15 seconds before you actually moved, so Oh, I was just thinking to say. Okay, you got a license registration insurance on you? Monkey twenty four ten eleven. If I could get that, that would be fantastic. This is a little unconventional spot, but we have to take what we can get. There you go. Hands ID and info. Megan Downs, out of state. All right, Megan, sit tight for me, okay? I'll be right back with you. Okay. 
All right, so it's going to be out of state, so we're going to run most of our stuff via the chat. It'll be 542 Los Santos Freeway southbound on a uh, gray Canis occupied by one female, no, 32. Okay, so at this point, let's go. Oh, yeah, this way. We got to do it this way. Runs name and LP for return. Give me that return, though. Ah, uh, shit. Unit 3 1 Alpha, please go. Play comes back to Megan's Downs, the valid driver's license, valid insurance, valid reg, but flags for arrest for possession, times 10 and solicitation. <laughs> oh my god, times 25? You got me fucked up right now. Are you kidding me? Three Lincoln eight one. Okay, uh, let's see here. Go ahead. I'm gonna just run the name because uh, I can get returns one. too. Okay. So I'm curious yeah, if this is just something really that fun. they're wanting to go with right this second, or if this is actually what she's been charged with. I'm kind of curious. I'm more curious than anything now. Uh, okay, so it's something that they're just going with right this second because their one thing was for speeding citations and. Uh, speed limits. So yeah, no arrest prior, at least on record for her. Uh, okay, cool. So, well, uh, we kind of know a little bit more about what is going on with that. So she'll be receiving a ticket today. Uh, so we're going to go do that. It's going to be Megan Downs. Uh, we already did that. Son of a bitch. Megan Downs. We're not going to put the plate in because she's out of state. We're going to go ahead and get her for a stop sign violation and go ahead and get her out of here. Uh, that was the first person I pretty much came in contact with all day and uh, was going to let her go too. And I even was like, okay, we'll cut her back even without talking to her and still managed uh, to see her do something right around the corner. I swear, as soon as people think that they're out of the eye of the cops, they end up just returning to exactly what they were doing before. It is literally that simple. And I even... I, Cut them a break. I could have turned left on Cat Claw where they just turned out of. Or no, I think it's like nowhere. I don't know. Some, something over there is is that. Uh, but I could have turned left there and went right back to my jurisdiction and everything would have been good. Okay, let's go ahead and get her out of here with a uh, stop sign violation. Thank you. All right, Megan, today it's going to be a stop sign violation. Uh, I was going to let you go there for a minute and, you know, just kind of do your thing because I thought you were speeding on uh, Joshua there. So I let you go, and then, of course, I saw you back on Panorama again doing the stop sign thing. So just be weary of the line, okay? I got a stop sign. Okay, sign the bottom of citation to sign admission to guilt, saying you take care of in court. She's got a tattoo on her stomach and shit. What the fuck is going on? Okay, there's a copy of uh, your ticket and your information back. You have a good day, okay? You too. Thank you. Okay, one good traffic stop later. Uh, we have one citation given to the uh, driver for stop sign violation. Again, I was going to originally pull her over for speed limits, but uh, I think it turned out that it might have been either someone else or I didn't get a lock on the vehicle. Also, my radar is set for 80, so I think I got her at like 60, so it wouldn't have locked anyways. But if I would have saw it, it would have still means I would have caught their speed, but unfortunately I didn't. So we're going to clear our call here. One King 24 traffic stops going to be code four with one citation given back to name. Okay. Walkie 24, you just passed me. Panorama Drive northbound 275, uh, about 95. Now westbound Marina Drive. One King, one King two four. Are you close to the for pursuit or for traffic stop? I was behind him there for a second, and I have now lost him. Last seen in the area of like two seven three near the motel. He just he's going uh, north on Panorama, just past the airfield. Just past the airfield. Okay, so I think I was behind him, so I would say he's definitely failure to yield. Going down 68. Alright, so we got one subject running from us right now. He's going to be on, like, some weird green bike. I've never seen it before. I think that was his buddy right there. 
Yeah, that was his buddy. So he's going down 68. We actually might cut him off. I'm going to go this way where his buddy's going because I have a feeling they might be uh, possibly meeting back up. But we got ourselves actually in a pursuit this time, which is kind of nice. Uh, but this is definitely his buddy over here. I'm almost for sure. He's going the opposite direction. But we're going to try to go this way and cut the other guy off if we can. We'll probably see him pretty quick. So I'd like to be facing the direction that he's uh, traveling. And it would be going towards Sandy. We Did he though? I guess we could set up a perimeter and see if he passes over here. He said he took 68. So chances are he would swoop back around. But if no unit saw him down there, then probably not. So... Fuck, man. I should probably go back to Marina. Oh, is this? No, this is his buddy. Three, Charlie, 435. I believe I might have that subject here at Postal 260. Uh, he's trying to buy a car at the dealership. If I could have somebody come back here to see if it matches the subject. Walking 24 in a row. Okay, so they have the subject possibly down here at the dealer. Uh, that means the bike is in the area. Uh, he probably ditched it and probably put the bike in the area. Walking 2040 units over there. Chances are he probably ditched the bike close by in the area then. 10 four. he's still over here at the auto dealership, so if you want to go get a head patch uh, while he's still here, I can try to keep him here while he's here. 10 four. I am a block away. We are closing. So this might be our subject. If it is, I can verify because he did pass by me. Uh, I'm going to need to see him out of the car. That's some dark ass window tint too. Uh, that's not him. It's not him. No. All right, gotcha. All right, y'all have a uh, like God damn! Damn, what the where the fuck is he going that fast? And he's gonna get pulled over. I guess that was him. <laughs> he looked a lot more fucking um, different than that, but all right. Yeah, he was wearing a helmet. Okay, well I guess that's the subject. And for he did clip a cruiser on the way out. Okay, fucking a. It's going down. This was the guy, and shots are being fired at police. So this is. Oh no! Oh no! I I hit my fucking. Oh no! I hit my fucking shit, bro. No, my controller. Oh no! This is gonna be toxic, dude. I am not gonna be able to do this. Fuck! 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 Oh, this is fuck, dude. Okay, well, I accidentally hit my controller uh, port on the desk and it fucked it up, and I don't have controller access right this second. Gonna have to restart my game, so we're going mouse and keyboard, uh, which is gonna be toxic. Back towards Sandy. We should shoot at him then. On Marina. Okay, he's going Marina. Fucking A. I need to get my rifle. We're gonna be East Algonquin, 269. Okay, he's gonna be coming out any he's second. A left now. Where's he going? Making a ride. Okay, he's coming out this way. Oh. Okay, lethal force is definitely authorized. I'm gonna try to do what I can, but I can't do much driving because I'm just gonna fucking kill motherfuckers. I gotta sit in the middle just somewhere. Where is Going he? Over the berm, I believe, trying to make it on to Joshua Road. Oh shit! Did you see that cruiser just fucking fly, dude? Holy fuck! Okay, he went over to the berm. I think this cruiser is fuck. <laughs> How do you do that? Oh, he's been shot. Heading back west towards Is he? Alfred. That okay. was not my screen. For some reason, I ended up over here. Right yeah, no, that was pretty bad. Okay, never mind. Okay. Trying to kill me. Trying to kill me. Yeah, well, buddy, everyone's being shot at right now. Come on, come on. Five minutes, 
Bravo 528, where you at? Gonna be right now, 301 near Marina. Shots uh, returned by police. He's on Marina Drive going through Sandy right now. Yeah, I don't know if we got him at all, but I definitely tried to return fire on him. Uh, he's shooting at all cops right now. Uh, we Dude, had him. West Marina. Middle lap. West Marina. We're gonna see him here any second. Heading back towards the speedy station and stop panorama. Oh, I got him right here. I'm going to be with Passing units. The now. We got to return fire. We have to. Primary unit, you're cleared to return fire as long as there's no other civilians. Heading Fuck, you would go. Stop lane, this motherfucking bitch. Fuck, dude. We gotta fucking try to follow him as best as we can. Oh, uh, I fucking hate Two keyboard mouse. Lane, Especially when there's someone behind you. We still got eyes on him. I'm gonna try to do this because I have no choice. If I back out, it'll probably cease and it'll end. And I don't. We're Not already in this in, shit. Uh, direct lane for northbound. Pass the east and it's supposed to be Fuck, he would Back, be going stop, that stop. way. Fuck, I was going to light him up, bro. How do I change my fire rate? That's what I need to know. Oh, he's fucking shooting at more cops, dude. He's going to get all the cops out of the pursuit here. And that won't help. Come on, guys. We got to return fire. Come on, we got to... I got to get up there with my assault rifle. I can do it, but... I was going to try to cut him off. I don't know where he's going. I'm going to go down. The he's going up. He's going up. That fucking Camaro. Get that. Or Mustang. Okay, so this is going to be the end of this. He's blocking himself in some type of area right now. And there's going to be... One way in, one way out. Unless he went off road and went down, that could be the case. Oh no! Back north. Shit! 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 Motherfucker, it's going down, bro. I did not think he was gonna come back up towards me, and I thought he was gonna shoot if that was the case. Is he good? So, yeah, no. Is he? Yeah, no, he's good. Just wanted to double check. Yeah, he's coming this way. Do we have like an air unit that does our you cyber service time? Where is he? Oh, it's going down. Where? Oh, right here. It's going down. Oh shit! I went prematurely. Get out of the vehicle. Come on, get up, motherfucker! Hold fire, hold fire. Suspect down. He's gonna be behind, uh, looks to be like a transformer or some type of tree. I got eyes, and uh, if you want to move up, I can hold you. He has not moved. 10 sir. We got him in front of the truck. Okay, we just killed him. We got him. That little stupid bitch. Oh my god, I went down in the right spot right there. That was perfect. Holy shit. Good fucking stuff. We pulled out the M4. We fucking roasted that motherfucker right there. Oh, heart's racing, dude. Heart's racing. Holy shit, we got officers down. We got subject down. Okay, we got subject 1015. We do. Vehicle's clear. Holy fuck. I, I also jumped out of the cruiser way too early, bro. But sometimes when I'm into it, you can tell I'm into it because I fucking jump out that bitch way too quick. You know what I'm saying? Holy fuck. That was intense, though. That was definitely worth it right there. We're going to get across uh, to the other side of the street. Our, our car's so good. I think we barely bounced uh, off this guardrail here. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. It could have been a lot worse. They got it blocked down. Let's go ahead and start blocking this road down. 
Damn, look at all the shots inside the car. Holy shit. He's, uh, he's got a... He's down. We gotta turn that. Do me a favor. Get in that uh, HP car and just flick on the siren on and off for me. Yeah, absolutely. Howdy. Howdy. You got a kit with you? Did you bring a kit? Uh, uh, I have one in my vest. A little small okay, one. I mean, we lit him up like Christmas, so that would work. You won't hand that to me. What do you need, Russ? Med bag for him. Okay, I'll go get one for my car. Hey, at least you could start something with that. Yeah, we could see. Thank you, Is sir. Is that better? Absolutely. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, oh. no problem. Oh, we got um, one more down in the tree. Yeah, guy behind the car is being treated. This other guy needs some help. Where does he need help? Uh, in this tree here. To be okay. HP. So, unfortunately, uh, yeah. one officer looks to be expired at this, this moment. We have the that's suspect that's down yeah, as well, that, too. I don't know if he bought it or stole and, it. And uh, I don't know. We had some good there. shots on target where we had just a perfect line. He thought all the units were that way. And when you're in such tunnel vision, you really can't see what is going on around you. And uh, we were able to just line up perfectly. We were like right here. So if his car is right there, we were on the other side of that guardrail where that ruiner is. Able to just line up with perfect shots, take him down. Um, I would say he hardly has many shots in his car here. We were able to pretty much put all shots on target. Every All the bullet holes on the other side uh, were on the other side of the car. Yet. I don't oh. know if the branch is being slow or okay. it's in the trunk okay. somewhere. Well, let's hope it's not slow soon. All right, we're taking off from here. We're going to go that check the um, the RV, uh, the Larry's RV. We're going to see if that subject possibly ditched his bike over there and then stole that truck or possibly bought the truck unknown. But I'm, I'm almost for, sur for, sur uh, for sure, for certain, that's not even a word. I'm almost certain, there we go, that he ditched his bike over there and then got another one. Uh, or got some other type of vehicle so that way he can take off so we're gonna double check make sure i got a unit coming with me just in case i'm pretty sure that there was only one person he did have a buddy on his uh on a bike as well too but at this moment we have no idea if he was really involved so there's no reason to go pull him over so let's hope that we can find the bike we'll be able to tie it in for evidence and kind of go from there but that guy opened up a can of whoop ass dude he started shooting at all cops we stayed back we kind of made sure we held our own there and uh, we were actually able to take out the subject and the other firing squad that was going on wasn't able to do much because there was a vehicle as cover. Didn't know where he was at, so they were just firing recklessly into the vehicle. I was able to come up on the side and just totally light his ass up, which was pretty sick. We got a Challenger over there. Did you see that bike as well that was on its side back there? I did, yes. Okay. Uh, once we get done looking, it'd probably be best if we went back to look to see if there possibly is a body that's accompanying that bike somewhere. Yeah. Uh, there's my guy over there who informed me about this. About what? Um, he's the one who informed me about the suspicious person with a helmet ducking behind a building. Uh, you see that Dodge over there? Yeah, the Challenger. Okay. Yeah, is he's the one who is he still me. here? Yes, he is. He uh, had a little bit of mental with the guy with the gods, and now he should be back. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's see. I'm gonna you go and talk with him really quick. I'm just gonna look around the area. Gotcha. Uh, if he gives you any any useful information, I'll have some to use. So tell you the same thing. Okay. Cool. I appreciate it. Yep. Alrighty, so let's see if we could locate a bike. I'm gonna just go ahead around the area and see if we got anything. We do have a bike there, but it was more of a chopper style bike that had like weird neon that was popping out from it. Uh, what I want to do is I want to turn up my spotlights really quick as well too. So that way it just looks a little better. I got like spotlight spots coming out of like no upward spotlights, which makes zero sense to me. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's see what we can find here. I know we're going to be able to find something because if this is where the vehicle was, he's talking with them right there. He had to have ditched it somewhere around here, though. It's not like he wouldn't have. He couldn't have traveled far because it would have been quite obvious to see some random-ass guy kind of walking around. I'm almost thinking he possibly went to the back of the mechanic shop or something like that. All right, and from there... Let's go ahead and see. I'm going to just check everything in this area. Because you never know. Come on. You're good. Oh, we got a dispatcher too. He went out for a little. Okay, so this officer has some information that he says might be useful to our investigation. So I'm just going to go ahead and go down here and see if we can chat with them. Maybe just relay that information back to us. I want to find that bike, but if we can't, it's okay. We already got the suspect. And uh, we really don't have to stress over it too bad. 
You ready for new call? Right, so I need to get gas too. What's going on? How's it going, sir? Stand oh, what's going? How about yourself? Ah, uh, another night, man. Down. So, uh, earlier today, I actually got pulled over by this gentleman right here, uh, right up the street from here. Uh, and I just so happened to be pulling in here to park and, uh, just admire the, the beauty of the county out here. Uh, and I seen a gentleman what is he that fucking wearing? sitting in Let's talk about looked it. like, like a local vehicle parked right here. Um, and when he got out of that vehicle, he took a bike helmet off of his head. And then he looked like super sketchy. Like he was like, well, that's definitely walking, our guy. Then. Like in like running, like you could tell he was like trying to duck, like as if he had just done something. Um, and I had noticed. Like, oh, a heavy he probably cop took presence, a so fucking. Oh uh, my god. Local authorities, uh, and this is the cop that happened to pull up. Uh, and I just let him know that the guy was kind of sketchy, you know, and they said that they were for somebody. So, sure. Um, yeah. So that was that was pretty much the, the gist of what I got. If I had to guess, uh, just based on like people and the things they do out here, you probably stole a local car and ditched the bike somewhere that you guys were searching for. From what this guy told me. So, what type of car was he sitting in? It was a black Sultan RS. Okay. Uh, another highway trooper pulled up like after you guys pulled out, and he like searched the vehicle, and then I don't know what he did with it from there. Okay. I wonder. Um, I wonder, sir, if he happened to be that one bike that we happened to saw on the side of the road. Uh, definitely not, probably, because when he passed by me originally, he had some type of, like, bright neon on the bike or whatever it was. I'm not sure what it was, but definitely wasn't, uh, that one. It seems they're, they're going fast. All right, sir, well, I, we appreciate the information, okay? Yeah, man, not a problem. Anytime, uh, like I said, you know, people are doing something wrong, and you can tell they're doing something wrong. It's better just to report it because, you know, you know, you wouldn't want somebody getting away with something like that. Oh, I feel you. Okay, well, I'm going to take off and go check a few places where Sultans like to hang out, so. All right, man, you gentlemen have a good night. All right, you as well, sir. Appreciate it. Thank you. Not a problem. If you need me, sir, just let me know. All right, will do. I appreciate it. Okay, so at this moment, he kind of just gave us information that I wasn't kind of picking out. Chances are the guy uh, took the car or took the bike somewhere, uh, ditched it, found a Sultan RS, took the Sultan RS to this location and bought himself a truck, um, which makes total sense. So I think at this point, being able to find that bike is going to be pretty difficult, if not impossible. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and just be 10-8 available. I've never seen a fucking prostitute during the day. This has to be an actual person. This, yeah, it is. I knew it. I show both you and two tango seven oh five ten eight. Ma'am, 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 ma'am. I know you can hear me. Stop it. Stop. Hey. What are you doing? Just hanging out, shaking your ass to the street. I mean, it's a nice day. It's sunny out. So you just decided to go shake your ass in the street then? I, I mean, why not? Uh, I don't know. I'm just curious. So you remember I stopped you earlier, right? Uh, oh yeah, on the freeway? I did. Uh, well, I think it was Route 68 or something like that, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. But anyways, so is this what we chose to do after getting a ticket for a stop sign? I'm, I'm just oh, hanging no. out. I'm oh, not doing anything. Do cool. I know, but it's getting eerily close to fucking prostitution. I mean, I'm just in good spirits. How's that? Okay, but what if someone were to stop by and say, hey, I'm looking for a good time. You get in the car, and the next thing you know, you're over there prostituting. Oh, I would never do that. Okay, but someone's going to get the idea if you're over there shaking your ass on the side of the road. That's kind of the point I'm trying to prove here. I got you. Okay, so... Probably better activities we could be doing besides doing that. In the end of the day, you're able to do that if that's what you so choose, but it's going to invoke the wrong people, so. It's also going to invoke hey. us, too. So, all right. Where is your vehicle, too? Uh, over there. <laughs> okay, you're parked in the abandoned motel parking lot where there's no parking. Well, isn't it public parking? No, it's, a, it's an abandoned motel owned by the city. Oh, uh, so much. I, I, I don't know. I just uh, came out to send the stories I'm doing. Okay, well, get out of here. Have a good day. Stop doing stuff that makes us have to talk to you. Okay. okay. All right. Have a good one, ma'am. Bye-bye. I definitely think she was trying to prostitute on the side of the road there. It's pretty evident that that was the case. Uh, she was shaking her ass on the side of the road. If uh, all it would have took is one person to stop by and it would have looked like a total prostitution... Uh, thing that's going on right there. We could have easily lit him up. Um, 
and cited him for that probably then again we probably would have had to waited for a little more information to come back as in we probably would have had to see them drive off and go somewhere uh to do some type of activity but uh, at least we stopped it before it happened because i was like i've never seen a prostitute on the side of the road there and then i was like wait she actually looks familiar as well too oh wait this is the same female that we stopped earlier who was in the silver jeep that's now pulling out of the abandoned parking lot so just not good activities that go on near the motel uh, especially why the fuck she made a u-turn saw that i was out this way and then made another u-turn to go out that way are you kidding me right now dude Charlie, three, four, one, one, two, two, four. go ahead Charlie, three, four, one. are you still in the county sir lucky 24 i am Three Charlie three four one. I'm gonna be out here two seven six with an individual with a chicken hat on. Oh God. Uh, looks like he's grabbing a ladder. He's driving all over the road. I think you've dealt with him before. Walking twenty four. Yes, I have. You want me to make my way over there? Yes, please. It's gonna be two seven six. Copy that. I'll be in route. I am a mile forty three out. All right. So <laughs> the chicken man is back at it again. Uh, I think most of our time that we interacted with him was actually going to be in the city there. Um, but it looks like he's made his way out to the county, which is going to be interesting. We've dealt with this guy all day. I totally don't mind if he goes out there and, you know, protests and do what you got to do for the chickens. Um, but 31 fucking calls of service for this guy is getting a little extreme. Obviously, that's exaggerated. But that's what it feels like, you know? All right, let's see what this guy's up to now. I wonder if he's detained. With the, uh, the blue hoodie. Uh, stated that he would be robbing other locations. I'm good. How about yourself? Good. I uh, pulled up. I thought he was having trouble maintaining his lane. Uh, it appears it was just on my end. So I asked him what he was doing. He said the Lord's work. And uh, I remember yeah, hearing your radio right. traffic. So I asked him if he was... He grabbed an extendo ladder out of his trunk here. Oh, good. Started walking oh, towards yeah. the sign. Said he wasn't going to be climbing up there. But if you want to have a chat with him, go okay. for it. Okay. So he brought out a ladder but said he wasn't going to climb up there. Exactly. I don't see how that makes sense, but all right, whatever works for this guy. Know. How how are you doing? Why, hello there, Sergeant. Um, I'm in a different uniform than I was last time we spoke, but that, uh, I, that I can see. But yet the voice still yeah, remains. I would hope. So what are we doing today? I see you found another Cluck and Bell ch uh, billboard. Yes, for I have. And uh, my partner here said that you're pulling out a ladder from your vehicle. Yes. And okay. As you can, okay. and as you can see, there is no building in which I can climb the top. That is true, but that's a billboard that you cannot be on top of as well, too. And who made that just? Well, that would be the law, my friend. Do you enforce the law? Or I am here to enforce the law. I am here to enforce the will of God. Okay. You can do that from a safe distance on the ground, but you can't go on the billboard, okay? Okay. All I right. Will attempt, I will attempt then to do such a thing. As you can see, I have run out of billboards down in the south. For I've come up north now. Okay. I greatly missed our conversation that we would have had had you been outside the Lucky Plucker. I mean, I'm usually everywhere. I've seen you pretty much everywhere today. But what do we have in the backpack, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, merely the tools of justification. Okay, and what does that consist of today? Several Sullivans, a wash rag, and... Okay, so I didn't make a big deal about it the last time you started defacing the other one. But if we are caught doing it again, my friend, it's going to be a pretty bad. You're going to be receiving some fines here. I don't think that you received any tickets yet from what you've been doing, but we're kind of starting to no, walk that thin line. So I've been walking the thin line ever since I came out of my egg. Okay, I can totally understand that. You are a chicken. You identify as a chicken then. Not only do I identify out here to the fact my mother was a hen, my father was a rooster. Okay, I'm good. Good to know. All right, so now that we've been able to make contact, what are our plans for today? My plan definitely is not to climb that ladder. Okay. Or find other subsequent signs that advertise such atrocities. Understandable. So we're going to stay on ground level and we're going to not walk yes. on that billboard, right? Yes, I will not walk on the physical billboard. We're going to walk underneath it or something? Very possible. Okay. I'm going to be honest with you. I will be in the area and so will this uh, deputy here. So if we see you on that billboard, which you will stand out considering the fact that it's a yellow background and you're wearing blue clothes, we will make contact with you. Copy that. 
Okay, new question. If I were to stay on the ground and therefore throw paint upon the billboard, <laughs> yeah. could I then technically be fine? Absolutely, because you're still defacing that billboard, sir. Okay. You By can any chance, do you know where I can buy an isosceline cutter? I, I would have to know what that is to be able to identify... It's a simple iron torch, for if I cannot stand upon it, I shall bring it down here to my level. Good. Um, I think it might be best for you to do a verbal protest in the end of the day, because all that stuff, all those actions are going to get you in trouble. It could even get you landed in jail. You understand, sir, that you have met me several occasions on which I have tried that round. I It's always I, gotten me here. I understand that, but we're, like I said, that thin line is becoming thinner if we're going to start using stuff to then bring down a structurally sound fucking thing, you know? You know what else is structurally sound good, sir? Two, three, what? Three, my state of mind and my fight. <laughs> is that right? Okay, I mean, if you want to call it that, that's totally fine. So I think at, at this point, I have nothing further because you have committed no crime, so I don't want to hold you up any, any longer. Uh, but I also want you to make the right choice and not commit any crimes after we're done talking, okay? Sir, do you possibly have a copy of the penal code so I can overview it and understand which laws I can therefore break? Well, I, I think that's a redundant statement. If You can't break a law, if that makes sense. Well, so. if it's not presently stated in there, then I can go ahead and do it. That is true. If you want to scour the penal code, that's up to you. If you want to go ahead and Google the San Andreas penal code, it will come back up there and you can go ahead and reference anything that you would need. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and make this really simple for you, sir. So I'm going to give you at this time a lawful order to stay off any billboards that you don't have permission to go on, okay? So okay. if we contact you in the future and you're on top of those billboards, then you're going to be taken in for uh, going against a lawful order, all right? Okay, you can hereby hear my testimony. <laughs> God damn it. I shall no longer go on top of the billboards. Okay, I think we both hereby hear that. I think we hear, <laughs> we hear it, sir. Okay, now, uh, to add on top of that, though, you cannot deface them at all from the ground. Do you understand? I shall not do such things. Okay, I appreciate Again, like I've said every single time, and I'll keep saying it because you have been super cooperative, I do appreciate your cooperation. Other than that, Deputy, are you are you good with him? I am 100% good. Okay, sir. You are free yeah, to traverse. My equipment. Yeah, that would probably be a good idea to retrieve your equipment and find another activity to do for today. Or do a peaceful protest. My peaceful protests, sir, have always landed me within your glorious sights, so I shall try to abscond. Okay, but again, every time you've been let go, so keep it peaceful and we got no problem. Peacefulness is the only way in which truth shall be attained. Mahatma Gandhi was peaceful, yet he may change. That is very true. All right, sir, you're free to, go. free to go. Thank you very much. Absolutely. You didn't read, did you retain his ID or anything or? Uh, I ran it, it's gonna be a Gomer. Gomer, yeah, that's the same guy. All right, Wonderful. well, I would I recommend exactly passing what... by again if you got time, just to make sure. Oh yeah, I'm running I'm running radar with an eye view and I'm sure he's probably gonna head up to Polito Bay near that factory at some point. I He's, so, he's uh, making his way there, slow and steady. Wonderful. Yeah, I don't know what he's protesting, but all I know is I'm hungry for chicken now. So. Yeah, well, he wants to stop the chicken killings and shit like that. It's a one-man gig he's got going on, so he's got a lot of lot of fighting to do. Well, he's he's like our Gandhi. All right, well, I appreciate you coming out. Absolutely. You have a good one. You too. All right, chicken man, you have a good day. Till we meet again, good sir. Absolutely. Oh, call me crap and shits. Alright, we're gonna be 10 8 from here. Uh, this guy is clearly on his his adventure to stop the chicken killings and whatever works for that man. Whatever works. Alright, everyone, that's gonna be where we wrap up this episode of DOJRP, getting in with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office in the marked and then slick top 2020 FPIU, which I actually remembered to switch over. Nonetheless, thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of DOJRP, and we will see you next video.